Again from the Fresh Meadows Motor Vehicles. Uh -huh. I just wanted to go over a couple things um, with you. Um, you took your test June 5th at 9.31 a.m. Fresh Meadows, Queens. Yeah. It was examiner number eight or eight. Uh -huh. We actually had to let that examiner go. We had to fire her. Oh. Um, we were reviewing your test results and it seems like you should not have passed. Um, okay. You failed to signal when leaving the curb. You failed to signal in traffic, and you had poor control of the vehicle, and for some reason, examiner number eight or eight actually passed you. Um, I have, uh, something to say about that. Number one, I was extremely nervous. Other people are nervous when they take their driving test. I, I was fully aware of what I was doing wrong, and she understood that. I drove well in traffic, and I did everything I was supposed to do. Uh, um, we're gonna have to revoke your license. You will not be getting it in the mail. This is absolutely unheard of. One second. My license. What? I don't know. Can you talk to me? I, I don't know. I don't know. No, I, I, I cannot. Yeah. Carmel, I mean, do you really think you deserve to pass? Yes, I do. How can you say that? Well, you could have hit somebody. I mean, you didn't even signal the right way in traffic. I don't think that you should be yelling at me were, right now. Were you drunk when you took the test? No, I was not drunk. Are you sure? I'm positive. I don't think that you should be imposing these questions on me. Well, I don't think that you deserve to pass the test. I drive extremely well, and I have no problem in driving. Oh, cry me a river, please. Anyway, you're not getting your, your Excuse license. Excuse me? You're using this poem with me? Cry me a river? Listen to me. I'm 17 years old. I think that I, I can tell when someone's a little less mature than me. Uh, I, I, this is extremely, and you extremely think, wrong. What I do not deserve this. Okay, That's Carmel, all. Carmel, not for anything, but think about I this. I think Carmel. Oh, sorry, Carmel. You knew you shouldn't have passed that test. That's not... No, that's not what I implied at all. Well, is it the reason why I'm using this tone with you is because this is the only way I feel I can get through to you. Because you're the one that's using this kind of tone with me. Your vehicle was swerving all over the place, according to this this no, report. No, 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 no. It wasn't swerving all over the place. I had all my teachers there. There were witnesses there. Everyone saw that I was right to pass. I mean, are you blind? Could you not see where you were going? No, I can see perfectly fine. Well, I wish they had given you a breathalyzer test that day just to see what was going I'm not on there. Drunk. I'm I'm not, I, I earned straight A's, I That doesn't mean A's anything. School. Don't please, don't even bother, you earned straight A's. Big deal, that doesn't mean you can drive. Is the reason why you wanted to talk to me personally so that you could give me attitude and not look bad in front of my parents? Dear, I'm not giving you attitude. I, I was sweet enough to call you and tell you you're not getting your license and you started in with me. And so I'm giving it right back to you. Yes, I made mistakes. But if I soon, if I made enough mistakes to get enough like points off my off the test, right. I think I would have failed. You would have failed. failed. Unfortunately, <laughs> examiner number here is he didn't know what the hell she was doing either, and that's why we got rid of her. And, and you know you have to see how are you telling me this if you're saying that she was unfit to do her job. She was that's unfit. She should have failed you. That's I mean, how do you not signal in traffic? That's like driving school 101. There was a lot of explanations you and I can go on and on and tell, and tell you on and on and on. But I'm going to report you. Teenagers on the road are absolutely ridiculous. This is a real world deal, not high school. You don't well, act maybe, like this. Maybe you should go to the legislature and maybe you can get a law passed. Oh, blah, blah. You don't even know what you're talking about. Yes, I do know what I'm talking yeah. about. I'm extremely bright and I think I know what I'm saying. Oh, oh blah, blah. blah. Excuse me, blah, blah. I mean, you're trying to say things out your ass that, that, you know, make no sense. Saying things out of my ass? Yes. I wouldn't trust you to drive a matchbox car, so there you go. <laughs> would you like to put a complaint to somebody? Yes, I would. Okay, let me tell you where to send it to. Send it to the DMV. That stands for the Danielle Monero Violations Company. <gasps> Stop! No way! We got him! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You're dead wanted us to tell you you weren't getting your license. Oh my god. This is a phone tap. Oh my god, I'm so embarrassed. You're getting your license, don't worry. I was thinking so bad, oh my god. Oh, this is a phone tap. Oh, this phone tap was pre-recorded with permission granted by all participants.